Hey you, yes, you. Thanks for checking out another one of our videos. Welcome back to our shop here in Payson, Utah. Today, we have a very special video for your education and entertainment featuring Lewis and a very custom Sunseeker Easy Tad SX. Check this out. In this video, we'll be focusing more on the powder coating than on the Easy Tad, but we would be remiss if we didn't mention the features that make this trike such a great entry level build. If you feel like you've seen this before, you're probably thinking of one of our Fat Tad crawlers that's built using the Easy Tad frame. So they look pretty similar aside from the super fat off-roading type tires. If you want to know more about the Fat Tired Crawler, follow the link at the top of the screen or down in the description. The Easy Tad SX starts at just over $1,500. It has a low center of gravity that makes it a blast to ride because of how well it handles. This was a trike designed to introduce new riders to the thrilling world of trike riding without emptying their wallets, which is great in this time of crisis. It features a triple crank set up front paired with an eight speed cassette in the back for a very usable 24 speed drivetrain. The smaller 20 inch wheel in the rear also keeps the gearing low for hill climbing. It has three way adjustable vertical handlebars set up with grip shifters. It comes stock with locking brake levers that function as a parking brake as you get on and off your trike. Over the years, the Easy Tad has been upgraded to include direct steering and slotted seat adjustment. The two-way adjustable seat allows you to change the angle to ride more upright or more reclined using the locking pins on the seat stays. And if you undo the quick release levers under the seat, you can slide the bottom of the seat to any position along the frame. Because of all the custom color on this specific build, we wanted to walk you guys through the powder coat process. We've offered custom powder coats at Utah Trikes for years now and it's something that our customers have absolutely loved it's just one more thing that really makes your trike that much more unique powder coats are created using a combination of chemicals and additives that are melt mixed cooled then ground into a powder that has a consistency similar to baking flour the process of applying the powder is where things actually get fun ben uses a specialized spray gun that applies an electrostatic charge to the dry powder particles he hangs everything up on the rack and when he starts spraying the powder those charged particles are attracted to the grounded parts think positive and negative charges positive charge from the powder negative charge from the metal parts opposites attract there you have it, end of story, it's magical. After the powder is applied, we put them in the oven to cure. The 375 degree heat causes a chemical reaction that produces that glossy, high quality finish that you see on our powder coated frames. Powder coating has been around in the US since the 60s and there's nearly a limitless range of color options. The paint doesn't scratch or chip as easily as wet paints do and the finish holds up incredibly well to less than favorable elements. Some of our popular colors are prismatic army green, any of the candy colors, candy blue, candy purple, these are all colors you've seen recently in our videos, neon green, mango, crinkle black, that's a cool one, it's got a little bit of texture to it, think rhino liner if you've seen that before anyway this easy tad was painted in candy purple and pearl white ben is going to take you through his powder coating process all right so we're going to paint james's easy tad and all of his fancy bits um this is going to get a really intense paint over makeover nailed it the frame and the chain rings are going painted purple with the spokes so the rest of the stuff's going to get painted white Let's get at it. <laughs> the spokes are going to get painted differently because they're a little temperamental. So just so we ensure a great paint job, we're going to paint the chain rings and the frame 
all together in one, and then the spokes are going to be all painted separately. We just finished up the purple. It turned out way amazing, actually. It looks so nice. Um, so now that we're all done with the purple, we're gonna knock out the pearl white. It's a lot of stuff, so we're gonna do a couple loads. Um, the first load we're gonna do is hubs, rims, and crank arms. Mostly the, the rims and the hubs, just so we can start lacing the wheels as we start painting the other stuff. So. Let's get to cooking. <laughs> That's why we're using the black rack today. So let's get let's get started. Yeah, big things are like the rack, the headrest bar, the seat back, um, mostly the handlebars. Some of like the little things is like the fender stays and like the rack stays, um, and like a big part is the boom. So just a lot of little things. That's gonna Once all the powder coating is finished, Luke and Ben build this beauty up in the shop downstairs. Along with the very custom powder coat, this Easy Tad also features our UT Custom Super Headrest, aluminum cargo rack, and super mounts. It's got two rear view mirrors, a menorah swing grip accessory mount, Shimano clipless pedals. It also has one of our custom 3D printed computer sensor mounts and a full set of fenders. Oh, and for a little extra pizzazz, it's got those red grips and matching red housing for the brake and shifter cables. After all the custom paint and accessories, this build came in at just over $2,500. Once the build was finished, Lewis did the order inspection and took it out for a test ride. A very entertaining, steampunkish kind of test ride. <laughs> Uh, Lewis lives to entertain, so... See how arrow I was? Super arrow. We hope you enjoyed learning a little bit about powder coats and our process here at the shop. If you want to see all of our custom colors, go to utahtrikes.com, click on the custom shop tab, then follow the link that says view all our color options. There's a bunch of swatches there. You can click on one of those to see trikes that have been painted in that color. We hope you find a color that you like. Contact us for a custom powder coat job. Thanks for watching. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on your notifications to stay up to date with everything going on here at Utah Trikes. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next video.
pretty businessy. Don't roll your eyes at me. <laughs> <laughs> Even though I was in a leather jacket, so that didn't make it breathable. You spoiled the whole thing. Well, this is going to be in the bloopers, isn't it? Yeah. Hey guys, welcome, welcome back to the Price. Utah Price. 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 Woo! Yay! Yeah. yeah. These I'm guys on. are taller than me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, if you made it to the end, this might have been an intro until I ruined it. Exactly. Welcome back to Hugging Loop. Get out of there. <laughs> Yeah, we'll do this. Not on the order. Hey guys, Kate here from Utah Trikes. This is Lewis right beside me. Hello, I'm Lewis. The crazy tad. Is that what we're calling you? Yeah. The crazy tad. Crazy tad. What else? Oh, follow us on Instagram. If you have an Instagram, we're there. It's just at Utah Trikes is our handle. YouTube is our professional slash business casual slash gotta be informative side. And Instagram is like the, hey, we're just a bunch of young people working at a tricycle shop in Payson, Utah. This is real life. Okay, we gotta go. Okay, bye. See ya.